all countries look upon our military forces with fear, not to mention admiration and desire. By wielding the concentrated powers of advanced science, you were born to be greater than human. You will be unbound by the foolish, naive ways of the world. Now grow and one day rule the Germa double six. Hello and welcome to One Piece 101, the series that breaks down everyone and everything in the One Piece world. Today we are going to be looking into One Piece's answer to the Super Sentai, the ever ominous and allegedly evil organization, Germa Double Six. Germa Double Six are a military branch of the Germa Kingdom, commanded by their ruling monarchy, the Vinsmoke family. Although quite interestingly and uniquely, the Germa Double Six are mainly known throughout the world as a fictional antagonistic force in the long running world comic series, Sora, Warrior of the Sea, which tells the story of a marine hero battling against the evil armies of Germa Double Six, assisted by a transforming robot, and of course the ever useful Seagull. The comic strip is used as propaganda to increase the support for the marines throughout the world, and allegedly the Germa Double Six were chosen as the main model for the comic strip's villains because of the reputation of the actual organization being so closely associated with the idea of evil. And this had the odd effect of spreading a mistaken belief that the German Double Six were a fictional organization, but the reality of their existence is quite possibly even more bizarre than the Sora comic could ever portray. In essence, the German Kingdom, home of German Double Six, is a nation without a specific location, and its entire territory is built on the shells of exceptionally large Denden Mushi-esque snails that have the ability to travel seemingly anywhere within the world and are even capable of scaling the red line. And with this incredible maneuverability, the German Kingdom favor two main brands branches of business, the first of which being general warmongering, as German Double Six act as an underground mercenary army for hire, being brought in to assist in anything from assassinating royalty to becoming involved in full-scale wars. And they are particularly effective in this field because whilst waging war, they don't have a specific kingdom of their own to defend, thus allowing them to expend significantly higher resources on offensive action. And the other primary field that German Double Six pursues is that of science. And in fact, they are one of, if not the most scientifically advanced nation in existence within the One Piece world, having crafted phenomenally futuristic weapons, and even even mastering genetic cloning, which is the mechanism by which the German Kingdom creates the soldiers for their army. So far, there have been six types of clone soldiers shown, including Type WB, Woman Balance, Type MB, Man Balance, Type MR, Man Reach, Type MH, Man Heavy, Type MST, Man Strong, and Type MSP, Man Speed. And while all of these types are clearly designed to provide certain physical advantages, the one thing they do all have in common is the fact that they all wear dark lenses over their eyes, for good reasons, I'm assuming, but none that we're privy to. The soldiers are also well known for their tireless training and fierce loyalty, existing for no other purpose than to prepare for their next operation. And the incredible cloning technology available to German Double Six comes courtesy of the knowledge and pursuits of the king of their nation, Vinsmoke Judge, a scientist skilled enough to have once worked alongside the legendary Dr. Vegapunk. And he certainly did not stop his genetic research of cloning, as he also sought to augment his very own children with superhuman abilities. And these children would go up to comprise the main fighting and commanding force of the German Double Six. Although the three children I'm referring to in particular are Vince Mokes, Ichiji, Niji, and Yonji. The genetic modifications enacted on these three siblings did not simply grant them superhuman abilities, but also left them without the capacity to feel any sort of empathy or sympathy, which was intentional as it was designed to sculpt them into perfect soldiers. But the German Double Six also consists of their older sister Reiju, who was not modified to the same degree that her brothers were, but was still tinkered with nonetheless. And as a result, she is unable to disobey the orders of her father, Judge. And then of course we have the black leg sheep of the family, being Vince Mokusanji, who was unaffected by the modifications enacted by Judge, thanks to the selfless actions of his mother, Vince Mokusora. But due to this perceived failure, Sanji was horrifically bullied by his siblings and eventually banished from the German kingdom, never to be seen again. Well, at least until he was. But before we get to that, the remaining siblings all received extensive combat training, as well as a signature piece of German technology known as a raid suit, which is scientifically augmented clothing designed to give an individual even greater abilities tailored to their specific brand of combat. Each of the commanders would also receive a special epithet that reflected their particular aesthetics and powers, being poison pink, sparkling red, electric blue, and winch green. And I'm sure you can guess whose name corresponds to who, but it should also be noted that the Supreme Commander himself, Judge, also has an epithet, being Garuda. And so with his commanders at the ready, Vince Smoke Judge and the German Double Six, expanded their underground mercenary operations, but eventually sought greater power in the form of the Emperor of the Sea, Charlotte Lin Lin, also known as Big Mom. In order to form an alliance with the Germa and gain access to their technology, Lin Lin agreed to a political marriage, offering her daughter Charlotte Pudding up for the cause. Now Judge, not wanting to sacrifice one of his quote unquote useful sons, then decided this would be a good time to make use of Sanji. And so Lin Lin had Capone Gang Beige kidnap Sanji on the island of Zo and brought to Whole Cake Island for one hell of a wedding. However, what the German Double Six were unaware of was the fact that Lin Lin was plotting to kill 
all of them at the ceremony and take all of their advanced technology for herself. After the discovery of this, the Vinsmoke family ended up forming a reluctant alliance with the Straw Hat Pirates and the Fire Tank Pirates who were attempting to assassinate Linlin. And let's put some emphasis on the word attempting here because their plan failed horrendously and all parties involved were forced to flee. In the ensuing chaos, Gemma Double Six put their full might on display with each of the commanders proving themselves capable of at least briefly taking on many of the top officers of the Big Bomb Pirates and going on to defeat an army of 10,000 men led by Charlotte Nestorte. From here, they also played an essential role in allowing the Straw Hats to escape from Totterland. However, just as the Gemma were about to withdraw and escape themselves, Lin Lin arrived and their fate at the time of this recording is currently unknown. Some more fun facts about Gemma Double Six. In the anime adaptation, the flag of Gemma Double Six was altered from a Nordic cross to a much less visually intriguing single indigo line with the number 66. Also in the anime adaptation of episode 839, Gemma Double Six received a special honor as the standard eye catches featuring the Straw Hat Wanted posters were replaced with a very funky one featuring the Gemma. Formerly, the German Kingdom, despite having no permanent home, were members of the world government. However, after learning of their attempted association with the Big Mom Pirates, the world government promptly ended their association with the nation. And finally, a truly useless fact. In One Piece Magazine, Volume 3, it was revealed that Vinsmoke Judge's name was originally supposed to be Saint Germain. But that pretty much does it for German Double Six. If you enjoyed this video and the content this channel produced in general, then please do consider donating to the Grand Line Review Patreon because the support of all of your amazing people is what continues to make this channel possible. And if Patreon isn't quite your style, then please do drop a like, favorite, or subscribe because it helps support this channel so much more than you can possibly imagine. And if you'd like to join the fun at any time, then please do head over to my Discord server where a wide array of shenaniganry takes place on a daily basis. And finally, please do comment with who, what, or where you'd like to see featured in the next One Piece, no one. Oh, and in uh, order to use their raid suits, all of the German commanders need to strip, making this a uh, very, very close family.